In this flight, we will be looking at the construction of the Montego Bay Bypass in the areas of Irwin to Green Pond and sections of Fairfield. The National Road Operating and Construction Company, NROC, has signaled a toll plaza for the Montego Bay Bypass in Irwin and it will be located close to the Fairfield Road Interchange. This is the construction of what is said to be the longest bridge in Jamaica. But is it? Records have the longest bridge in Jamaica as the Bustamante Bridge in St. Thomas. Will this bridge clear it of its title? Here's a map showing the path of today's video. From Erwin at A to Green Pond at B. Then we will head back to cover the hidden sections of Fairfield, where it is said that the interchange will be built.
They are now digging down this hill and have now backfilled the underpass and the drain pipe. So soon you will be able to see the road coming through this section. This section that you are seeing here is a runoff for the vehicles coming from the green pond area. And you also have a few more being built along the bypass. We have just flew east from Irwin and we are now heading north towards the Green Pond area. This is a view of the rain coming towards me and unfortunately it did prevent me from finishing the sections of Iron Shore but I will be there again to complete my task of giving you the full update of all these sections of the bypass. Work is moving very quickly on the Montego Bay Bypass and it is about 40% in thus far, especially in the Irwin to Iron Shore sections. The Bogue to Alice Eldermeyer Drive section is also picking up pace too, but not to leave out the section where Fairfield will connect to Irwin. That section is quickly coming together.
We are now in the Green Pond area where it seems like Czech is building a road interchange. Don't go anywhere as yet, because we are flying towards the Fairfield area, where the two sections will be linked. And you can also take the time to enjoy the views of the inner sections of the Montego Bay communities.
In this view, you can see the Fairfield section taking its alignment. Also, don't leave us yet. There's something at the end that resembles that interchange. Stay tuned. It's coming up. My viewers, does this look like the building of that interchange? Leave your comment in the comment section. And also thank you for watching and your support. Thank you very much.